friend Catherine, today is Tuesday, and you're coming to visit me, and I'm very, very excited. In just two weekends, you are gonna be here, and it's gonna be fantastic. We're gonna hang out, we're gonna go to an independent bookstore, and we're gonna make really terrible decisions, like staying up really late, because I don't do that already. We have moved into the countdown for our birthday and for spring break for me because they fall at the same time. There are about two and a half weeks until I go on to spring break, which means there's a little under three weeks until we turn the big 2-0. There's not gonna be a one in front of our age anymore. That's gonna be weird. I'm excited to spend our birthday with you. You should be getting a package from me soon that I bought in like, November or something that it's getting shipped to you. We are gonna hang out. We're gonna have dinner for our birthday I have three doctor's appointments in one day because you know, I hate myself Funny story. So I was texting mom saying that I'd set up all of my doctor's appointments And they're all on the same day so that way I can get them all over with and I can enjoy the rest of my break And she said well good because then the next day you will be the healthiest that you have probably ever been and I was just like yeah, but if I'm healthy what am I supposed to be paranoid about? Because as you know, and as mom knows, I'm incredibly paranoid about everything and I'm severely convinced that everything is gonna kill me, because that's normal. And so mom told me that I can just start being concerned with the fact that I'm being followed by spies who are trying to steal my identity so they can do super secret things in foreign countries and that she's going to get a phone call next semester asking if they were doing sub-Saharan financial transactions while I'm in England and then wonder whether I'm actually in England or if I'm part of the CIA and I just never told them and then discussing the fact that only the CIA will know if I'm in the CIA that they will think that, I'm, that I'll am that i be safely tucked away in the city and not in sub-Saharan Africa. So the third piece of exciting news that I have for you is that I'm going to a Mountain Goats concert on the 16th of April. It is a Wednesday night and JD is doing a solo show in Somerville, which is about a half hour from where I live right now. And I'm gonna go, I bought my ticket, and it is possible, although not crossing my fingers or holding my breath for this, that I will get a press pass to go to the show and I'll be able to sell my ticket and I'll be able to be a little closer and I'll watch the show and I'll do a review for it. And it's also possible that I could be getting an interview with John Darnielle of the Mountain Goats. I'm sort of freaking out about that. So other than that, I don't really have a lot for you and I will see you tomorrow.